Harper Journal. Might as well have a look at that, I guess. See if there's something in there. We're running around trying to find the borders of that blight. He runs each of Last Light proved to be highly... Uh, the ruins of East east of Last Light proved to be highly dangerous with deep biting shadows. Another suspicious one is that house on the hillock a little further on. Seems dark and empty, but voices come from there. One of the others swears to me that he heard a child's laughter in soggy Tianqi warriors. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the house we found, so that's fine. But what the hell are we missing? This is different. This is something that I can see. Okay, let's have a look. What we can find out. <sighs> I love this game. I don't know why, but I do. What is this? He who was. Shadarkai Gloomweaver. Oh, and that's a raven. Do you seem to be something that might try to kill me? Not necessarily. Okay. God, there's still a party going on outside and I can hear the music. It's kind of funny. I still really want to know what the thing is that, like, is looking at this place. Oh, that's a night orchid. That doesn't count. Pretty sure. I don't want to walk in, right? Like, I really don't. Oh, wait. Ha. There you go. Wait, but this isn't the area where we found those blights last time. That was over here. Okay. Um... So it's this, it's this thing. One needle blight. Okay. So then there's probably at least one, if not two more. So then the question becomes, is there a way for us to deal with that situation properly? Is it just the one? This just seems to be too far. Oh, wait, no, there's one over there, too. That's the vine. 72 hit points. How fun. So I see a needle blight, a vine blight, and then one more blight over there. Okay. I think what I'm going to do, because we now know how to get around it anyway, is I kind of want to talk to Mr. Creepy Person over there. Okay. On the diary, sure. Why the hell not? I don't let these words tell my story. The curse came, most ran, my Ron included. It's been too much... Torches. Oh, pouch. Pouches are always good. Okay, so the needle blights we'll deal with in a minute. 
first. Uh, where's where's the creepy guy? That was over here. Sorry. Went the wrong direction. I get the feeling that east is going to lead me to the mountain pass. Which I don't know if that's a good thing or not, but I'm planning on cleaning that up anyway as well, so... It's not necessarily that bad. Okay. You don't seem like you'll kill me. Hi. Where lies your guilt? The waning moon. What's going on here? You walk in the darkness unafraid. How curious. Oh my god, I switched to beaver for a second. I heard random moaning. Oh, sorry. A fair point. Perhaps this one could assist us. Gonna have to be more specific, the buddy. The lie silent. The raven asks, will you be their voice? Depends who murdered this woman. She is not the victim. Nay, she is the perpetrator. This woman tended a bar where she took her patrons, her friends, into her confidence. Promised their secrets were safe with her. Yet she turned their words into knives and stabbed them in the back. They died because of her. And to this day, her victims lie unavenged. Okay. She's dead. How much more can she pay? Death is not the end. Merely another beginning. Your point being? I seek a record of this one's crimes. Written in her own hand. Through it, I can summon her spirit. And force her to face trial for her crimes. Okay. And why would you do that? My reasons are of no consequence. Your soul sparks with vengeance, with fury. This is your chance to torment a murderer, to make her suffer. Will you take it? Or as I get paid. The death of heroism is close, I see. Go to the distillery. The one she calls the Waning Moon. Find the ledger and bring it to me. Where's the Waning Moon exactly? <laughs> Sheer curiosity. It's not here, right? Oh, really? That's a location in? Wow. Okay. Sure, man. Sure. Why the hell not? If you do not approve, you can leave. You should probably not steal from the dead. Just yet. Alright. Don't want to draw any attention. Oh, right. I wonder if the gods are watching me. Do not look at me like that. I don't need any attention right now. These boots have seen everything. These boots were made for walking. That's just what they do. Might as well. Gently. Might as well open this rice. With ease. Companion. 
should be enough, right? Nice. It's not much, but you know. He's free. Okay, so that pretty much eliminates this part of the map. Cool. Intriguing. All right, so let's go deal with the blights, shall we? We will leave soon enough. Leave? No, not until we've dealt with Madeline. You are so creepy, you don't understand. I can feel the curse withering. It must be the light. Thank you, game. Didn't realize that you were going to be walking so far ahead of me what to do. that you were going to be taken by the curse, Mysterian. Should I pick this up? No idea what this does, but okay. All right. Let us have a look. Really? That we can clear up this area, get the chests, and then from there on out, we can have a look at the rest of the game. Uh, ba -ba -ba. Can't have disadvantage against the target. Uh, of course not. God damn it! What to do? I literally realize it the moment I click. That's what I wanted. Let's really, am I just gonna be crit fishing now? How many of them? One, two. Four, five, six. And then the vine blights. Okay. My knees are starting to ache. Okay. Out of sheer curiosity, what do your resistances look like? No necrotic. Slightly predictable, I guess. That should be good. Wait, so where are all of them? There's blood in the air. One, two, three, four, and then these three, I guess. Okay. Why am I doing this? That should be fine. Get damage. What are you at? <sighs> I hate this game, I swear to God. Don't mind me. 
What are my odds of hitting you? 90, 95, okay. I'll just like, try to fucking finish you off and then take one shot at you. And then that leaves the big one if we can I'm ready. take a shot at it. That would be perfect. So let's just. How's your deck save out of sheer curiosity? 75. Nice. Eighty percent for a guiding bolt should be fine. Nice. And then I think Hysterion still has one shot. Which is perfect, because that means if we can get into range. Five hit points. That ought to be fine, right? Fuck, I just realized I made a mistake. Hold up. We have another thing. We still have Dread Ambusher. <laughs> to finish him off. <laughs> Whoops. Mistakes were made. Yeah, this ought to be fine. Dash? Yeah, figured. Cool. Better, uh, movement speed than I thought you would. Yeah. Should be fine. Uh, I've pretty much used my turns on everybody, right? So... I can't even catch my breath. Alright. Here we go. You guys. Let's start dealing with this, uh... Situation, shall we? To be fair, don't I... Okay. Asterion has a difficult time getting advantage right now, but he doesn't necessarily need it if I can get Shadowheart into melee. Although these things do blow up is the issue, right? Can't be surprised. Good to know. Explode in a needle burst. I don't think that's going to be a ton of damage, but I should take it into consideration. I also don't have a third level spell slot anymore, so I can't Spirit Guardians. So... At that point, the question becomes, is there a way for me to get advantage on my shot? Not really, right? And there is. I could move over right here. Which puts him, like, in the middle of the line of fire, I guess. Which, that's not necessarily good. Since all four of them are gonna get turns after this. But it would let me deal more damage to one of these two and then finish it off with, uh, Shadowheart. Possibly. Although I don't necessarily want to 
Don't know if I want to put my odds on that. If I'm being honest. 60, 60, 60. I'm like thinking how I want to deal with this situation. Sterian loses out on like 7 damage on average. If I don't hide him. At which point, I think it's just better that I move Shadowheart into melee. It's gonna happen anyway. Yeah. I think we move Shadowheart into melee. I do go Sick Flame. That doesn't matter because she's unaffected by the curse. Radiating Orb. Hey, nice. Shadow Curse is gone. So that's good, and then this way we can get a sneak attack out. What was the last thing that happened? Hmm. Is there any argument to, like, chuck you off? Would that deal damage? I have a bonus action left, I might as well try. Well, now we can move in a little closer again. Okay. This should be fine. Here we go. Don't kill me. You shouldn't. Pretty sure, but you never know. What was that? Need these are ranged attackers. How much damage was that? Wait, 2d8 plus... Oh, damn, you just rolled really high damage. It's 2d8 for a hit? Holy crap. That's a lot of damage. Shatter all four of you? I could fireball, I guess. Wait, am I long resting after this? Possibly? Probably? That seemed fine. Still on my feet. <laughs> ah, crap. Well, that's annoying. At this point, I think we should be fine, right? Oh yeah, sneak attack's just not gonna work, but it's fine. I don't need sneak attack right now. You have got to be kidding me! You know what? Fine. Fucking offhand attack him then instead. Are you kidding?! Uh, <laughs> Come on, man. Okay, at this point you're just taking the piss with the situation. What the fuck? What is this bullshit? I'm 
missed all three of my attacks! You motherfucker! At least you missed all your attacks. I'm assuming the last blight attack was a disadvantage. Yeah, I figured. HP2 bingo is coming up and I can feel my addiction. Uh, blah, blah. I have no idea why I just said, uh, actually. I, I wanted to give an answer and I legitimately just didn't. Um. Oh, dark. Fuck. Come on. Can't stay idle. Um. No, that's great. Wait, is it, is it, it's a tournament, right? Or am I wrong on that? Nice. That dealt with the situation. Jesus. I think I've just proven that I'm getting too tired. Time to press ahead. It's weird because like I've been pretty much sleeping like half this day, half half of today. What's that? What is that? Excuse me. Shadow cursed vines. What? Can, can I turn my well, camera? Thank you. Not as bad as it could have. Apparently, I found a key. Okay, then. Anything of use? HP two bingo is coming up, and I'm feeling very scared. <laughs> I mean, I I don't even. Like, here's the thing, right? I've seen you guys play, like, bingo, and I, I don't, I don't know. I don't even know where I'd have to start, if I'm being perfectly honest. I legitimately have no clue. Like, I kind of get it. It's like, you know, you have to do, what is it, like, 13 out of 25 as quickly as possible, and you can kind of, and you kind of have to click on them yourself. Like, I get the rules, that's not the issue. It's just, like, really weird for me. Like, how do you even, you know? How do you know what to go for? Okay, so that cleans up this part of the map. Which I think means at this point we're just gonna continue further down here, right? I think so. <laughs> so, let's teleport back to the last light in. For a little bit. So the good news is that also means we can probably sell some more shit to a uh, hubbin. Need anything? Should I talk to Jahira about the? Because Jahira, because I, I did find some stuff out, so maybe I do need to talk to her about it in a minute. Once I've solved, like, sold, like, half my shit. I don't think I need a rusty dagger for anything. Or a rotten banana. Or just rotten food in general. Uh, no, I'd like to keep the potion of feather fall. Sometimes that is helpful. Alright. 
105. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Oh. get more money if you barter than if you trade um i think if you trade the only thing you can do is you can give items for items is the issue and i don't necessarily want anything from this anymore so i just barter because it's easier and quicker that's really the only reason to do it like that also hey shift how you doing Do I have any? Oh. Sell this, I guess. You trade, you can just slide it over and get the money. What? If you trade, you can just slide it over and get the money. Oh wait, really? Wait, that's how that works? Huh. Never mind. <laughs> Apparently this is faster. Okay then. Good to know. That was weird. And just sell shit. What the fuck? Okay. Well, how long have I been playing this game now? <laughs> 50 hours? That's not good. It's just, I'm so used to like the DOS 2 system where you have to like actively click barter and then do the whole trading thing. Like, I'm used to that, so I was like, eh, trading's probably you trade stuff or whatever, but apparently, okay, but apparently it works like that, and good to know. Here, I want to talk to you for a second, because I don't know if you have new stuff to say to me. The shadows haven't consumed you. Good. I agree. Yeah, okay. A search burdened by unnatural darkness. But don't let that the, you. Technically, the way that trading works, and to be fair, that's really powerful in um, in DOS. In DOS, what, hands ha what you can do is you can give them too much money, or you can give them money, and their opinion of you will change to the positive, which A, I think, makes them help you in combat, and B, if I'm not mistaken, also gives you better prices in the long run. I've just been too lazy to spend a lot of money because I don't feel like you have as much money in this game as you do in DOS 2. But if you just give money, then I guess it's... If you just, like, want to give them money, then... Or if you just want to sell stuff, I, can, I mean, oh god. My sentences are not coherent anymore. I really should not be streaming for too much longer. I think I'm going to... See if something happens during the long rest, and then... Uh... Open this cage, you mounting asshole! Is there a reason why there's like a thingy here? Was it some characters let you trade if you click the trade icon during dialogue? Oh, yeah, yeah, no. Um, I knew that... Oh, I didn't know the Quartermaster Tally traded with me, though. Where's Quartermaster Tally? No, I, I know that, because that was also a thing in DOS 2. I just haven't really used it at all. I just really, I really have not been using it. 
anything I could take off your hands at no cost to myself? Don't roll a one. 20 works. Cheeky. What? Since you're asking. Ooh! Supply pack. Oh, this is nice! If you're all right by Jahira, you're all right by me. She looks much older to me. Is that a graphic setting sync? Probably. Um, it's just, yeah, I'm playing this on, on the lowest settings right now because otherwise I get really bad frame rates. To be fair in a little bit, that should be fixed because I'm talking to a, a friend of mine to get better equipment for my PC. So hopefully that's going to improve stuff. What do you have? Shield of Devotion. Okay. You gain one level one spell slot. Nice. When a foe hits you with a melee attack, you can use a reaction to knock it prone unless they succeed a deck save, and you get eight at third level. Uh, that's not bad. Incandescent Staff lets you... Ranged spell attack plus one. Firebolt, fireball. Oh, you're gonna make me do this, aren't you? Oh, that is so good. Oh, you have so much stuff. Stop having so much good stuff. Oh, crap. I'm gonna have to start selling so much. Cloak of protection! <gasps> yes, please! Oh, yes, please! Oh my god, you have so much good shit. Why haven't you sold it already? Sold what already? Wait, why haven't I sold what already? All your stuff? Um, because I'm a hoarder. <laughs> I think that is the legitimate answer. <laughs> I don't. I, I don't know. The jewel. I always think that I'm gonna like need these later down the line, which is like the reason that I tend to hold off on selling stuff like that. That's legitimately the only reason. They bear their weakness after dealing damage with an unarmed attack. The wear against. Okay, so that's that's good on monk again, I guess. Orc skin. Rare medium. Yeah, that's not happening. Shade Clinger Armor. Is this? Rare Light. Stealth plus one. Advantage on saving throws. Eh. You want T-Scale Mail? What is... What is Shadow Heart wearing right now? Githyanki Half Plate. So technically, something like this would be better on her, right? Add your dexterity modifier to your armor class. Does not impose disadvantage on stealth. Gain plus one to initiative rolls. I mean, it's better than what I have right now. The issue is just I don't think she has... She has 14 decks, so... That doesn't really do anything. So I don't think that's worth it by itself, necessarily. This... Oh, wait. Hold on. No, because you still need to have proficiency with it and Asterion doesn't have proficiency with medium armor so no way he does because he's a ranger wait Asterion could wear this hold on <laughs> nice. Get two weapon fighting. Successful saving throw against a foe spell. Deal. Sure. Wait, I'm thinking about this now because technically. Wait, hold on. Can I? Take care now. I wanna. I wanna quickly check this because I think multiclassing into ranger gives you proficiency. On medium armor, right? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Armor. Light armor, medium armor, shields. Oh, 
Holy shit, that's insane. Hello, chum. That would be great. That means the AC would jump Stop up to. I only hope I brought enough to see us through. That would mean I would get 15 plus the three plus the three that he has right now, next level four. Which puts you to like Should you buy the Dex gloves? Uh no, I did not. I haven't found those yet. So not yet. I haven't, uh, I haven't found the Dex gloves yet, sadly enough, so. Um, this would be one free casting fireball compared to what does Gale have right now? Melf's Acid Arrow. Eh. This would be better. Just one free casting of Fireball, I guess. Be a lot better. Okay, so what do we what do we want? I'm just gonna I'm not gonna like buy it just yet, but I wanna know what I need. So I want this. I can leave that for now. Because these are I'm assuming these are dies. I'm probably just gonna sell the dies, let's be honest about this. Um Amulet of the Harpers, you can cast shield for free. Yes. <laughs> yes, please. Um, protection from missiles. What the hell is protection from missiles? Amplifier reflex system. Uh -huh. Ranged weapon attacks against you with disadvantage damage is half. That's not bad. I don't think I'm going to buy those yet. Um, I barely have anyone who uses do weapon fighting. This I don't think is worth... Increase your strength score by two. I mean, by its, like... <sighs> Thought one of the sellers here had that. Maybe, I just... Maybe I've looked over it, possibly. Works well with that armor for anyone that can use medium. Yeah, that's true. That is true. Um, so this is, like, just hands down something I want. It's not even a question that. This is fine... In your first, you can reduce this weapon's enchantment by one to increase your armor class. Uh, but this is two-handed, and I'm not really using two-handed. The scrolls I can hold off on as well for now. Uh, cloak of protection, definitely. That's not even a question. That push my speed because it's so cheap, and it's literally the best potion in the game. I don't know if targets might be funny. I don't think I'm going to take the flying potion yet. Scroll of fireball, lightning bolt and stuff would be cool later down the line. So this is 5,000 gold pieces. <laughs> this might be problematic. Oh, this might be problematic. Okay. Alright, time to sell everything. We'll buy it back if we need it. Fuck it. At this point, it's... I, I think I have found my important things that I want. Because all of that is so ridiculously good. I'm going to keep the ingots because I think I can give those to Hammond. Um, what else? Oh no, the ball I used to play with the dog, so... Probably get rid of the thingies. <laughs> Tried playing Divinity Original Sin again because I didn't feel like a third run of this so soon. Can't, just can't get into that. I need PG4 now. <laughs> Dude, they've <laughs> only just released this. <laughs> Drag it over and you don't need to slide them over to Max. Oh, nice. Cool. Good to know. Thank you. Uh, are there any spell scrolls that I don't need? Anime dead. Eh, I like keeping the spell scrolls because I do use those. A couple of them have saved my behind already. Where are the dies? I have like a bunch of those, don't I? 
Feels like I should be selling dyes because I really don't care about that, to be perfectly honest. Sinful red... Like... Oh, wait. So, you're saying if I just do... Oh, nice. Good to know. Am I ever using this wyvern toxin? Probably not, right? It's only a D8. It's fine. Get rid of it. Um, pass out a trace. I'll keep... I'm not keeping this. <sighs> not keeping this. Um... I'm keeping this just because it, in case I lose my weapons again, like I did last time. That does speed up the process, I will say that. Is this current armor worth anything? Yeah, it probably is. Uh, 1085. Uh, but his armor is not going to be replaced. It's going to be um, Asterians. Hmm, to be fair, this is still decent. What do you have that I don't want anymore? This. Uh, oh, fuck no. I was going to put that on someone. I don't remember who anymore. I'm definitely keeping that. I think this is fine to keep. Bloodstones. Oh, these are just normal bottles. I'm selling so much stuff because I really can't use half of this. And I'm still only at 3,000 gold pieces. Ah! thoughts I'm gonna keep yeah I'm not using this let's be honest about this uh, this one I wanted to use I remember wait what's the first thing that I'm definitely I'm definitely getting the scale mill right this is not even a question yeah this isn't this isn't even a question there's no question about me taking the uh, the the UNT scale mill I think Right. Plus one to initiative. No disadvantage on stealth. Stealth. Fifteen plus three is eighteen AC base. Yeah, this is not even a question. And as you said, if I get the glove, if I get the dex gloves at some point, like, like, yeah, it's it's that's just not happening. Uh, I'll sell this. It's fine. How does it look? Damn, that actually really does not look bad. Holy crap. Uh, you can have the spider silk armor. It's fine. Oh, nice. Um, other than that, cloak of protection I'm definitely getting. I just don't know who I'm putting it on yet, and no, but nobody has a cloak yet, so... Pretty sure that's free. Or, not free, but I can definitely sell that. What does the hood do? What hood? Oh, this one? Um, it's a monk weapon. If you deal damage with an unarmed attack, you get a plus one to your save DC. So pretty much if you hit, your stunning strike's better on a monk. It's really, like, that's the that's the one, like, really weird thing about this game. Is, like, the amount of items that I see that I'm just like, this is a monk item. And that's where it really stops, if you think about it. Alright. Uh, I am... Pff, I'm gonna keep this for now. Am I? Am I ever switching back? Am I ever switching back to the Joel Tree? I'm gonna forget that. Fuck it. Let's be honest about this. Don't, don't lie to yourself, Seven. Don't lie to yourself. By the way, did you see that one hit boss kill using money? I have seen the video pass by on my YouTube channel, I, uh, on the, on my YouTube. I haven't watched the actual video yet. Uh, but I'm assuming it's similar to... 
how in DOS you can just like throw big bags on creatures and kill them. I I would assume that's the way it works. I do I have a large bottle? Uh, what do you still have? Why do I have... Oh, right, because I was thinking maybe for a thingy. Where gains advantage on melee attack rolls will surrender. No. This, this I was keeping because maybe... Because it seems to be possibly related to story stuff. That's the only reason I'm keeping that. Alright. That ought to do. I'm at 13... 65, Poisoner's Robe, um, that's also one gold piece, which is funny. What is this? Heartlight Bomb. Huh. Get rid of the Void Bulbs. Get rid of the Bone. Get rid of the Hat. I think that ought to do it. This is kind of the most I want to get rid of right now. Staff is 2,000, so I'm not buying that yet. Amulet of the Harpers. Who would be wearing that? Probably get rid of the Magic Missile, I guess. I don't know why you're wearing the Amulet of Restoration, if I'm being honest. What amulet do you have here? Lightning Blast. Wasn't this, like, shit, too? Yeah, because nobody can use this. Because I don't really use lightning spells except for with Gale, and then usually I use Fireball on him. Not really, I don't know if it's a spoiler, really, just the stats of the weapon. Oh. Eh? <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll look at the video. If, uh, if it passes by on my, uh, on my, on my thingy again. I might actually just look it up after the stream, to be perfectly honest. Um, what was I doing? I was checking if I would use the shield amulet. Why do I still have this? I don't know. So yeah, I'm definitely using this on someone. Let's buy it. Was there anything else I still wanted? God, you have a lot of shit I want. Where has advantage on saving throws? I mean, that's good, but it's not worth it to spend money on right now, I think. I think this is fine. Yeah. I think this is good. Take care now. Alright, nice. So now we have an... 18 AC Asterian and he's gonna turn into a 19 AC Asterian a little later well on my second run I realized I had worn a dog collar on one character <laughs> nice nice oh nice sorry I think that's funny I'm sorry uh, let's give you the Amulet of the Harpers for now. Um, nobody has a cloak yet, right? So I guess I just put the cloak on Gareth at that point? He's kind of my frontliner. Might as well. No one's stopping yet. Seems like, honestly, just the best item puts him to 24 AC. Holy crap. Okay, I'm sorry, but this looks awesome. Holy damn, I love the way this looks. This looks really good, holy damn. Huh. Um, for now, I'll keep that. Who do I want to put Pass Out Trace on, by the way? Because I might want to use that at some point. I mean, sure. Is that, that Send that over to a. No, never mind. Shadow Heart. 
can't afford to stay idle. You're having past that trees, right? Right, nice. Anyway, um, I think that's it, right? For now, should be. Am I forgetting anything or anyone? Uh, fails a saving throw against one of your spells or actions. They gain mental fatigue. Actually, this happens so little. This is probably better. Evasive shoes. Who am I giving that to now? But what do I have? I've click heals, which to gain speed. I don't really use these, but then again, I do want to put them on someone else, probably. I don't like these boots. Do I want to just do this and then replace these by these? Put me to like 25 AC, because why the hell not? I mean, fuck it, why not, right? I don't think the clicking of the heels on you is necessarily that good. Clicking heels might be better on... Oh, right, but you have other boots made for walking. I've been using the Featherfall boots on you because I'm probably going to use those at some point and I don't want to give those away. I can probably sell that at some point. I'm going to keep this for now. The tech thoughts I definitely want to keep because you never know. Where that could be helpful. And then I think that really does it. All right, cool. I love that you can see the cloaks here. Yeah. Make that 25 AC. Yeah, I love it. 25 AC. Like, holy damn. That's awesome. To be fair, two of those are from Shield of Faith right now, which is going to go away, so it's 23 base, but like, holy damn. 23 AC, though. Just 23 base. Alright, um... Do I feel comfortable enough to continue on? I think not. I think I'm going to take a long rest. Because yeah, it was ripe with magic. Pretty sure. Well, yeah, pretty spent. Alright. So let's go to camp. Oh, I will. I'm all chatted out. A word with the chief. Okay. I apparently I was playing as well. Um, I need Couple to take, for your thoughts. I need to take you with me in a minute. All right. Um. Best be on my way. Hmm. Where's Wooly Boy? There you go. A blushing Hi. apple begging to be plucked. Raphael's angling for the girl's soul. Mole's an obstinate one. If she's of mind to team up with Raphael, there's no changing it. <laughs> she's stubborn, yes. Bold as a lamb cavorting in a lion's den. But as ambitious as she is, Mole's no fool. One way or another, she'll see there's no winning Raphael's game. And she'll walk away. What if she doesn't? Then Raphael collects another trophy, and Mole sells her independence to the Hells. You've seen what happens when a bound soul reaches for freedom. I can't imagine what cruel penance Mole would pay if she were ever to resist that fell bastard. 
Cultists have taken your father to Moonrise Towers. Florix confirmed that. Then we know our mission. All roads converge at Moonrise. Can we trust Florix? I was 11 when the Counselor spotted and slayed an assassin who stalked father from the shadows. I was 13 when she brought word of a goblin warband advancing on Rivington. Her keen scouting saved a hundred lives that day. The Counselor's loyalty to my father is beyond question. She's as steady as Tyr's heartbeat, as upstanding as the Sword Mountains. Father's at Moonrise Towers, and we need to save him. Both must have some reason for taking your father, but what? They want violence, they want control, they want Baldur's Gate. Who better than Grand Duke Ravengard to surrender it? Who better than the commander of the Flaming Fist to dismantle its defenses? They will infect him, and the city's guardian will become its ruin, unless we put a stop to it. To Moonrise, then. We can't and we won't. The shadows be damned. Okay. Um, I'm gonna do one small thing. Tell me, what can I do for you? I need you to remain in the camp for a while rather than on the road. I question the wisdom of that decision, but so be it. I'll be here in the meantime, idling away the hours. I just need a minute so I can take Carlac. Don't worry about it, you crazy bastard. Uh, Carlac. You and me need to have chat. Copper for your thoughts? Yeah, get over here. Aces. Hey, look, it's level one. She's level one. Okay. Um, I'm just quickly. I'll slide in. I'm not gonna play with Carlac, but I do want to see what happens when I take her with me to, uh, Damon. Oh my god, soldier. That's Jahira. THE Jahira. Yeah. Know her? Not personally. I mean, I wish. She's an absolute legend. Years ago, over a century, Jahira was part of a group that saved Baldur's Gate from Saravok, a ball sport trying to plunge the city into war. You're a fangirl, My mom sure. used to tell us stories about them. The legends who protected the city from evil. She said Jahira was a powerful druid. Adamant. Tough. I've told myself those stories a thousand times since. I never thought I'd meet Jahira. She's a hero, and I was always... some outer city kid. Can't believe she wants to talk to us about working together. What a day! Okay then, crazy lady. So, hey, we've got this soul coin, right? Thing is... I think I can use it. My engine can, anyway. Zariel used to top me up every now and again when she wanted me to go after an especially wicked target. Got a coin slot in your heart or what? Sort of. Next time we find ourselves toe to toe with something we want to squash, drop a coin in. See what happens. Cool. Fuck yes. Now I just need something to sink my teeth into. That's not gonna happen because I'm not taking you with me, but hey. Hi, Damon. 
Aha! Thought I sensed an infernal. What are you doing here? Same thing as you, I reckon. Trying to stay out of the shadows. Hold on! I know you! The weaponsmith, right? Drafted into the blood war when your city was swallowed by Avernus. Not too different from my own story. Well done making it out alive. Same to you. Though unless my senses deceive me, you brought a bit of the hells back with you. Infernal engine? Who needs a heart when you've got one of these to keep you warm? Thank you, Zariel. Forget warm. You're burning up. Might be burning out a piston ring. Or leaking oil. Mind if I take a listen? Please do. I've been dying to find an infernal mechanic. Now that's hot. Too hot. I think I could sort you out. But I'll need some infernal iron and a lot of luck. You mean like the iron we have? Hey soldier, we've got some infernal iron already. Let's give it to him, eh? Sure. Please let this work. Mmm. The weight of it. And that blaze of chaos. I can't imagine this where my heart should be. Must be quite the experience. Give me just a moment. I think... There. You'll have to install it, I'm afraid. I don't think there are thick enough gloves in all the realms to protect from that kind of good. That feels... Good. I'm still burning hot as hell's hole, but I feel less... Changeable. Cheers, mate. Pleasure. And as for the heat, I haven't got any solutions now, but I'm not giving up. Could be if the combustion chamber had its own insulation, or if we had some kind of enchanted coolant. Let me sleep on it. I just might be able to work something out. Hopefully the next time I see you, I'll have something promising to report. I'll need more infernal iron either way, though. So keep your eyes open. Take care. Nice. Damon's upgrade didn't cool me down, but it did juice me up. I don't think I've ever felt more powerful. Let's find some... We'll find more infernal iron and get you that second upgrade. Sooner rather than later would be good. I feel like I'm burning serious fuel. Did I already have to? That's what I like to hear. Now, let's trot. Standing still is making my skin itch. All right. Need anything? Perhaps you've misplaced it. I'll be here should you find it again. What? Oh, really? Let me out. Need anything? It's perfect, really. Flawed Helldesk Helmet. What does this do? Builders plus two to saving throws against spell constitution saving throws plus one. Nice. I don't really heal others anymore, right? There you go. 
This should be better. All right. Um, what is your helmet? Intelligence seventeen. That's still decent, just because of the firebolt. Now we can go back to camp. Oh, whoops. Hey, soldier. Oh, come on. You don't mean that. Oh, fine. All right, and we'll go get at the ready. Gale again. And then we should be fine again after we've had a long rest. Tell me, what can I do for you? With pleasure. There we go. Elminster's not around, so might as well. With haste. Oh, whoops. Still breathing. All right. Despite everything. Light on my feet. I was hoping you'd come to chat. What do you need? Catherine Torm, what do you think of him? Difficult to say. A fellow servant of the Night Singer would surely be an ally to me under most circumstances. But something doesn't add up. I'll need to see where his allegiances truly lie. Very serious of you, but go ahead. How are you faring? Well, I'd be lying if I said I hadn't been dwelling on becoming a dark justice here. Perhaps seeing the power of Shah unleashed on that land is keeping the thought in my mind, but don't worry. I still have plenty of room for you in both mind and heart. Talk about all that's happened to Fine. us. Fine. What's on your mind? How am I holding up in your estimations? Quite splendidly, to give credit where it's due. You and I have shared some good times together, and it seems we have plenty in common. Considering all we've been through, I think I was very lucky to find such favorable company. And attractive company too, no less. Alright. A private word would be nice. Tell me, what can I do for you? Hmm. Nothing much. All right. Uh, I will be honest. I don't really know how I'd build like Gale and Carlac at the moment. I haven't really thought about that. to have a chat. What about, my dear friend? You know, I feel a connection oh, between us. Like we're two souls walking the same path. You might be a little naive in the ways of the world, but I see promise in you. Ambition. Why? what do you mean naive? Uh, just that you have a... Big heart. You like doing what's right. So I was thinking, what would be the right thing to do when we get to Moonrise Towers? When we come face to face with whoever is controlling the parasites in our heads. Kill them? To destroy the colds and the evil forever? Gods! 
Now try to think outside the box just a little. Consider the parasites in our skulls and think how many others have the mind flayers infected. Hundreds. Thousands. And they're not just goblin trash. There are powerful people in the worm's thrall. Whoever's waiting for us at Moonrise Towers controls it all. But if we can take that control from them, imagine the power we'd wield. Till we transform into Mind Flayers, you mean? That's just the thing. If we control the parasites, then we can order them not to change us. All the power with none of the tentacles. I'm just saying, there's an opportunity here. If we can control the tadpoles, we can keep ourselves safe and liberate the world from this evil. I'll consider it. Do. It's not often the universe hands you something like this. We'd be fools. To Here's the thing. It. Of Gareth course, this all does a lot for power. To find Probably this, uh, not that. Moonrise, but I'm feeling optimistic. It's it's probably that's like the 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 limit. Were you dancing? What the hell? Hey, soldier. I. Well, I'm not feeling so good. My engine. It's getting worse. Feels like it's going to burst out of my chest. We need to catch up with Damon. See if he's thought of a way to fix this thing. If it can be fixed. What happens if he can't tune you up in time? Well, I imagine it's lights out, Big K. And then it'll be just you, your parasite, and the wild yonder. I'm sure you'd manage. But this old girl's got a few things to do before it comes to that. Right. Intriguing. Let's go to bed. Perfectly 80. The voice of the Absolute is strong here and getting stronger. Hi. I don't know how much longer I can resist it. But it's good to see you're making progress. You took an unexpected route here. You did a brave thing, saving those people in the grove. Doesn't seem like my help did them much good. Call cultists caught up with them. Don't be so hard on yourself. It's not your fault the world is wicked. You did the right thing. The hurt runs deeper than she's willing to show you. What is it? The voice of the absolute. Strong <coughs> this time. Excuse me. It just doesn't stop. We are being bombarded by waves of telepathic energy. 
Wave after wave with hardly a breath between them. I almost dare not rest. Each wave a set of orders to the infected. The order for your transformation has been given many times already. I just hope my powers last long enough to see this through. I was like, wait, who's trying to kill me? Oh. Eh. Not really my problem. Wait, would there sell stuff? Really? Thou hast now a bosom companion. Take care that thou art not distracted on thy quest. Seeking the comforts of the flesh. You mean Shadowheart? Because I wish you were my bosom companion. Recall that in time, all becomes dust and bone. Okay. I was wondering if I could buy stuff from him. Would have been funny. Um. Wait, so we've had the chat with Carla. Okay, hold on. Let's... Because if I recall correctly, I do have one more piece of infernal... What's it, right? Seem to recall. Do I? Don't I? Maybe? I don't? Really? Is like, or is it in the chest? It might be in the chest. What's inside? Uh, uh, let's, uh, make this a little bigger. I have so much stuff in here. I should sell some of this too. So I'm gonna keep forgetting taking the uh, barrel. No, it's not here. I know I, I, I'm pretty sure I had one more, like... Infernal ingot. I am ready. Who desire? Huh. Okay, well, anyway. No one stopped me yet. Not important. Um, okay. So, with that, I am going to cut the stream here.